Not one. Not two. But three. Three intertwined fates. For the support of the company over the last year, how fucking out of touch are we? I've never really voiced my concerns on Genshin Impact because mainly I don't really think I have that big of a platform. I usually leave it to the big dogs and I'm just like, hey, y'all take care of it, y'all got it. But I do I do voice it on Twitter, uh, although many people don't follow me there, which is fine. I don't, dude, I feel like it's time. I don't, like creators are getting called out and, and listen, whether you want to keep quiet or not, that's completely up to you and it's, it's fine if you keep quiet. Like I get it, I understand, but I'm not going to. I mean, there's a lot of things that I disagree about what they're doing and, and how they're doing it and the way they go about it. <laughs> dude. Three fucking fates, three, I mean, I don't even know what goes on in their in their little like their little circle where they decide how many fates they're gonna end up giving us and they're like in their little meeting and then they're like guys what if we upgrade from two fates to three and then everyone in the fucking meeting, yeah good yeah good idea I don't get it man they must be like like they really must be patting themselves on the back they're like guys we upgraded from two to three this is great. I don't know how fucking out of touch they are. And Genshin has now lost like a million plus followers on a certain website. I, I really don't know what it is. I know it's the Chinese version of TikTok. I, I don't know what it's called, but they've lost a lot of followers over the last like, uh, I, I would say week or so. And uh, I guess that's an attempt to boycott. They, they've gotten review bombed again, I'm pretty sure. And uh, also companies that have collabed with them have also been unfollowed for some. That makes no sense to me. What the fuck? What has KFC done to you? What is what has Pizza Hut done? It doesn't make sense. I guess that's Genshin's way of, of boycotting if sure. Three years, three years for three wishes. I that's I mean, for me, it's pretty simple. You you allow anyone to choose a standard character, like at the least a standard character for free i mean i've been playing this game for three years i still do not have a mona just let us pick a standard right just give us a free five star selector okay you, we get to choose between dia or tainari or mona or whatever and uh and that should be that, that should be fine that's like the least that's the bare minimum you got honkai star out here giving free ass fucking characters that are actually good by the way uh i haven't even tried dr ratio but from what i've heard he's good and then we get what do we get guys? What do we, what do we get? Aloy, yeah, yeah, Aloy. Like, it's a joke. It, it's a fucking joke. Genshin, it seems like it's a fucking cash cow to, to Honkai. Like that's what it's for. It's, for, it's to fund Honkai. Like at this point, that's what it boils down to. I mean, it also doesn't help when Honkai gets literally every single update that we've been asking for, for Genshin. Guys, we want more resin. What do we do? Let's increase the trail base power for Honkai. Cause why not? Why the fuck not? I don't know if Honkai has, has artifact loadouts but I'm, there's there's plenty of updates that i've seen and i'm like like what the f we've been asking for this where the f where is it in genshin and then we finally get <laughs> we, <laughs> and then we finally get the, the the little notification where they talk about artifacts and everyone's like loadouts loadouts and then <laughs> we get the blog and it says Yes, you can sort through artifacts a little bit quicker now. <laughs> like, what the fuck? This is not what we're asking for. It makes zero sense. They just, they, 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 they take our feedback and then they'll like, they'll flip it in a way where they're adding it, but they're not adding it. It doesn't even make sense. Don't get me started with these goddamn, the, these versions either. Uh, I mean, to be fair, I, I used to stream the versions, like the live streams. Every single time I would wake up at 5 a.m. And I'd be like, fuck yeah, I'm about to, I'm about to react to this. It's about to be hype. We're about to get some new shit. Dude, for the last year, I haven't even bothered waking up early. I, if I'm up, like even then, I think the last version, I was up at 5.30. The, the thing started at six. I didn't even bother staying up to watch it uh, or to stream it or do anything. I'm like, fuck it. Like there's no point. I can just wake up and I know the gist of what's gonna happen. It's, it's, it's banner reveal, events, Is that, that might be it. The occasional, oh guys, we added a new spot in the game, a new uh, a new region, a new area. Uh, so now you can explore for two days and then when you're done, you're out of stuff to do. And then just a combination of everything, these mid ass patches. I don't even think we're asking for much. I really don't. Like it, it should not hurt your pockets in any way to just go out of your way and give us uh, a, a standard care. It shouldn't. It really should not hurt. Even if you were to give us like a random five star, like like so, literally something at random, just any random limited five star. If you were to just hand us one, 
it's not going to change much. It really won't. If anything, it'll just make people happier and they'll, they're still going to spend money. If they if they, if they they want to get something, they're still going to get them. They're still going to play your game. They're still going to grind primos. The only thing that it does is incentivize them to, to further play your game instead of getting mad and unfollowing you on all these goddamn websites and cr criticize the fuck out of your game. And now you have all these creators creating this drama and now you have to come back with something and 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 try to fix it what are we like a temple is that what we're gonna get probably hey guys we heard your your concerns uh here is a free temple enjoy now what like uh, is that is that it the funniest thing of all this is that when tectone voices his opinion on genshin now albeit it is pretty aggressive for the most part most of the time i guess sometimes you know could be a little nice about it but for the most part he's probably shitting on the game and and you know deservingly so but uh when he says it it's a problem right fucking riots everyone telling him to to uh, to unalive himself just plenty of horrible shit you know probably written by a bunch of 12 year olds 13 four, maybe 50 maybe but then when the cn community does the same shit and they voice the same concerns everyone's like Oh, see, it, it doesn't fucking make sense. It's like that one meme where it's like thing and then thing in Japan and everyone's like up in fucking arms about it. I don't know, man. I don't know why we can't criticize this game and like not get shit on for it. I want the best for this fucking game. I don't want to I don't want to keep getting on every day and dreading playing it. Like, I mean, yeah, this is my job, but I also do like the game. I do like the game. I enjoy playing it, but it's been getting harder and harder to, to enjoy playing it when like I'm, I'm getting on every day. I'm doing my dailies. I'm spending my resin and then I'm logging off and that's just about it. Now, of course, I try to make it fun for the videos and for whatever, but not giving me much to work with. I don't know. I feel like these talks need to be had every once in a while. They can be healthy for the state of the game, too. I would hope that Hoyover sees what people are saying, you know, including me. That'd be cool. But um, I would hope they look at a lot of these videos and they actually, you know, take it in and, and take a step back and then think about what they should be doing and not just continuing with this formula that they have and continuing with this greediness for absolutely no apparent reason when clearly you've shown you've been generous in other games and 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 then for genshin you just all of a sudden want to be some some goddamn elon musk jeff bezos ass motherfucker like it doesn't make sense greedy as shit talking about some fucking three intertwined fates what am i gonna do with that like dude go shove them up your ass i don't need those three fates fuck you bro i log in for three days and i get those fates like it's the same shit if I have a Welkin, I log in for three days, and then those rewards that you've given me over the past year of support is the same exact shit that I can get for three days of work. Work, play, whatever. I play for five minutes a day if I have a Welkin, and I get the same shit. What's the point? What are we doing here? At the end of the day, um, I wouldn't be criticizing the game if I didn't like it. You know, if I didn't actually want to still be playing it, there'd be no point. I would just drop it. I would just, just you know, I'll be... I'll be gone. Now, of course, this is, yes, this is my livelihood. So, okay, you can you can argue that. But at the same time, I've already told you I like the game. And at the end of the day, if I really wanted to, I could just fucking switch to Honkai and, and call it there, right? I feel like most of what I've said in this video has probably already been said by other people. And it's fine. I'm just another voice. You know, that's pretty much it. Uh, another video that hopefully Hoyaverse takes a look at. They have like their little meetings and they're like, oh my God, guys, these guys are criticizing us. Oh, look at these big creators are actually, they're actually, they're talking back. They're, they're expressing their concerns. And then my videos in that pile, I'm just another head pretty much. I'm, I'm another tally count, I guess. I just want what's best for the game. I really do. However they decide to go about it, you better know what the fuck you're doing. <laughs> Tread this carefully, because what you do here might actually, maybe not, but it might impact your game. So be careful and start rewarding your fucking players. It's not that hard. At the end of this, if I don't end up getting a Mona from this shit, we are going to have problems.